Tonight, the state of California is bracing for fire danger. To the north of us, millions could have their power turned off starting at midnight. And here in San Diego, local crews are preparing the public for a possible disaster. News 8's Amanda Shotsky is live in the college area where crews performed a live fire demo. Amanda? Tonight, we have learned that San Diego Fire and Cal Fire are both beefing up crews this week. Now, tonight here at Fire Station number 10, they held an open house, a demo informing the public about safety and fire preparedness, but also showing them what it looks like to fight those flames. When a fire ignites, every second counts. On Tuesday, San Diego firefighters staged this demo at Station 10 in the college area. Every minute the fire doubles in size, we don't put the fire out. Showing the public how they practice for a disaster while encouraging them to do the same. We always recommend to people is that they create and practice an emergency plan for the members of their household. It comes not only on National Fire Prevention Week, but a week when fire danger is high across the state with hot, dry, and windy conditions. The Santa Ana winds are, are, are blowing. It's just one of those where I know that that's a, a potential that we need to be ready just in case. Millions in Central and Northern California are bracing for widespread blackouts. Well, I'm about it, and um, I think it's a over precaution on their part. Pacific Gas and Electric says it plans to begin turning off power to 800,000 customers in 34 counties starting after midnight on Wednesday. And when those conditions align, we look at whether or not a public safety power shutoff is necessary. PG&E have asked people to prepare to have no power for as long as a week. Meantime, here at home, while a power shutoff has not been announced just yet, that could change. But firefighters are beefing up staff standing ready to go at a moment's notice. Essentially, we monitor pretty much minute to minute what the weather does. And during this time, we are very aware because of past experience. And again, San Diego Gas and Electric has not announced a power shutoff here just yet. But tonight, the company did warn about 30,000 of its customers that there is a potential for that to happen as early as Thursday. For a full list of those who might be affected, you can go to our website. That's CBS8.com. Just click on the hot button. Carlo, Marcella. All right, Amanda, thanks.